welcome to the Financial Independence Life. In this episode, we share our travel experiences to the world. Tarzir monkeys and then go to the river cruise and then we're gonna go to the chocolate hills the famous chocolate hills see you there if you like this content please support my channel by subscribing and clicking the like button for this day trip we took the ocean jet ferry from Cebu to Bohol which is about two and a half hours long arriving in Tagbilaran the total round trip ticket costs about 800 pesos, which is about $14. All right, we're now in Tagbilaran City. We're going to our yeah. tour. We're going to meet the driver outside. Now let's take a tour with Tagbilaran. On this day trip, we will be going to visit the Lima and Butterfly Park, Rio Verde Floating Restaurant, Tarshir Conservation Area, Chocolate Hills, and Bilar Man-Made Forests. Also, along the way, we stopped by the Immaculate Conception Parish, which was unfortunately closed. I'm not going to have to Oh, wow. Ito yung kanilang process ng kanilang life cycle sa bago sila maging butterfly. Oh, wow. Larva or also known as caterpillar. So you can touch it. Pwede nyo hawakan po. Dahil yung, di ba may mga caterpillar? Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh my god. 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 Oh Going to the Lobok River cruise. Lobok. I've been the chef. Rio Verde Floating Restaurant is a river cruise on board a floating restaurant that takes you for a one hour cruise along the Loai Lobok River. It's open Monday to Sunday starting at 11.30 a.m. 
On this cruise, you can indulge in a mouthwater in Filipino dishes, including grilled meats and seafood. My favorite was the Kong Kong chip, which I couldn't get enough of. Hi guys, Hi. welcome to our YouTube channel. <laughs> and we are taking you to our River Cruise. Alright, let's get going. Alright, let's get some food in the Lobok River Cruise. <laughs> Alright, we're now in the Tarshir. The Tarshir conservation area is where you can see and visit the smallest primates found in Southeast Asia. The sanctuary was established to protect these endangered species while also promoting eco-friendly tourism. We're now at the Chocolate Hill. Okay, I'm going up uh, Chocolate Hills, checking it out. Trying to beat the rain. Wow, look at that. Chocolate Hills is declared the Philippines' third national geological monument and is dubbed as the eighth wonder of the world. There are about 1,260 chocolate hills in Bohol. They got its name from its unique formation and rich vegetation that turns into chocolate brown during the dry months.
So day two of our trip to Bohol was so much fun and more than what we expected. We visited the butterflies, Tarshiers, we had a wonderful meal in a river cruise and we got to see Chocolate Hills. Tomorrow we'll be going to Oslo to see the whale shark and go canyoneering. Please join us. Thank you for viewing my content. I hope you have enjoyed it.